misogynist. I always find in the black pill community and also in the MGTOW community, uh, the perspective on women is very toxic. Like if men weren't any worse. Uh, a lot of these black pilled people really just start hating for no reason. Just because somebody's, um, you know, doing all right in life. Um, they always hate on people's looks. Um, and y'all just come off as, like, standoffish. I had this interaction with what I assume is an incel, and recently, oh wait, let me make sure this thing got, okay, that was here, thought I had the Bluetooth, but, um, <clears throat> so I was at the card shop, right, um, playing a little tournament, I haven't gone there in like a few months and uh, it took me a while but I finally got the deck that I wanted to build um, so I went and you know I just tried to have a good time I knew I was gonna get my ass beat so I didn't really care but uh, I, I lost the first two and coming into the third round I was like ah oh. I told the guy like ah oh, it's gonna be an easy win for you the gentleman was, uh, he was a little, he was a bigger guy, you know, um, and he gave you that impression that, um, I don't know, I don't really take care of myself, but at least I'm somewhat presentable, um, but this man was literally wearing a South Park Towley shirt that hasn't been washed in probably a few weeks and he was wearing long jeans covering past his knees um, it seems like he had a problem breathing because he was a mouth breather and if you guys don't know about mouth breathing um, that's an actual black pill that is very accurate being a mouth breather for continuous years of your life will make you deformed unfortunately um we're back again so this man you know i've seen him there before and he's done pretty good you know i've always lost and i assume he knows that i've always lost but um basically i'm in there we're playing digimon by the way i have a black x antibody deck and i just start you know doing what i do um i got a pretty good hand um, and at first it was going normal, he was just saying the effects, I was asking him some questions and he was cool about it, but as soon as the, the, the tables were turned and, um, I got, I got in with a little advantage, you know, in my deck I just swing and, and take out the other person, and basically his deck, Jessmon, does the same, um, but I won, you know, he, uh, I won the first uh, round, he won the second, and then I took it home with the victory for the match. And uh, there's one part where he was telling me some effect of this car, it really didn't matter. But then I went to like, you know, ask um, when like I could activate my effect. And he's like, after I play this and this and this. And he just like had such an insult. Uh, rage built up inside him. I've been nothing but cordial, and um, if anything, I was looking for guidance from him. And uh, basically, it, you know, it, it turned out pretty good. And at the end of the the match, he was like, "There's nothing I could do. There's nothing. There's nothing." He literally got his lineup, and uh, uh, it was just kind of cringy he was talking about it to the other people there um anyways i i had told the guy um that i won the match and um i forfeited 
shortly after because I needed to see my peeps. Um, but yeah, I mean that was that was you know they got so much rage, and I could only imagine if like a woman was to reject them and you know because first to get him like outside of his comfort zone to actually approach a girl and on top of that for rejection immediately um i could only imagine what kind of rage would be uh shown that day that's a little example um but yeah Insult people. Why do you guys hate women so much? Um, or maybe particular uh, females? Uh, Y'all probably ain't gonna comment, but comment down below what type of woman you hate the most and why you think that's justifiable. Um, you're gonna look stupid doing it, so I advise you not to. talk about an OG um, everybody knows Kent um, if you don't know Kent maybe if I feel uh, technical wizzy I might put a little clip of him here if not oh well um, Kent you know he always had them uh, very deep and personal talks where he would basically just go off a problem with uh, women going on dates with guys that aren't gonna so-and-so get some and uh, pretty much take them for a fool you know they go on a date she's all nice and stuff and then when he goes to pay she lets him and then the dude thinks just cause he paid for the date he can get some pussy like goes home after not even getting a kiss goodbye um, finds his number to be blocked and uh, he starts raging you know I, I don't believe it you know that all of it is real you know I feel like he's putting it on on the camera but at the same time if you're continuously rejected for the entirety of your life, maybe you do just go kind of mental and just snap. Um, but, you know, from last I heard, Kent, he was doing, you know, decently well. Um, he, he got intimate with a woman 
and uh, that was his girlfriend for a while, but last I heard, they broke up. Um, you know, it's crazy. So, like, Ken, Ken is an OG, you know, the, uh, Brandon, um, savvy guy, Oreo man, he's also pretty amazing. Um, I still watch him to this day. He's a lot, um, he's a lot more articulate. He was before, but before you would also have like snippets of him like, you know, raging. And um, especially like when he was in the bathroom and shit. Um, it, it was great. Um, but he kind of gets it, you know, he understands being raging is not going to help him in his uh, pursuit of the good life, as he says, you know, sipping his expansive drink and with a bad female, um, you know, so I'll, I'm going to go ahead and tell you one solid game tip to all the black pillars out there if you go out and do good stuff you go out and you contribute to society we're here um we're here getting dropping clothes off you know so yeah, the reality is, if you're a good person, people will like you. And that sometimes includes females. But it's okay if they just want to be friends with you, too. But yeah, so get your money up. Contribute to society. Watch a shonen anime. Um, and... Uh, be yourself, bro. Just be yourself. If you're if you're yourself, you know nothing will go wrong. Just as long as you're not an evil person. Um, and straight off the bat, you're you're pretty much, I'd say, one step before evil. If you voluntarily eat meat on a regular basis. Um, so that's another thing. I will get into my militant veganism soon um besides the black pill um i am a militant vegan so yep all right that's gonna be it for today